Hi, today I'm going to show you how to reset a purge counter on almost any Brother inkjet printer with a numerical keypad on the printer itself and no touchscreen panel. If you have any doubts, a full list of compatible printers can be found below. This guide should be used to clear error 46 or the unable to clean error on Brother inkjet printers. And it's worth noting that following this procedure does not actually empty the ink tank, just resets the purge counter, allowing you to carry on printing. Before we start, I'd like to make you aware of a few variances in how the buttons may appear on your particular printer. Start may be down as menu, or set, or even just be a green button. And stop may be referred to as exit, or just be a red button. Now the first step is to get your brother printer into maintenance mode. Depending upon the model of your printer, the method of doing this may vary. However, for most modern brother printers, please try the following. With the printer turned on and ready to print, remove the power cable from the back of the printer. Now hold down the start button and reinsert the power cable. Keep the button held down until the screen reads maintenance. If your screen does not now say maintenance, it will need to put into maintenance mode using an alternate method. Both of these methods can be found in the description below. With your printer now in maintenance mode, it's time to begin the process of resetting the purge counter. Step 1. Type in 80 using the numerical keypad. Step 2. Use the down key to locate the purge counter. This will be displayed as the word purge, followed by a series of numbers indicating how full it is. Step 3. Use the numerical pad to enter 2, 7, 8, 3. And this should zero the numbers after purge. Step 4. Use stop to return to the first stage of maintenance mode. Step 5. Press 9 and 9 again to exit maintenance mode. Your purge counter should now be reset and you can resume printing as normal. If however it has not cleared the error message, I would advise going through this guide again, following the instructions to the letter. If the error persists, please let us know in the comments below. I hope you found this video useful and I'll see you next time.